Now, cryptography has advanced quite a bit through the years. It advanced with the mathematical basis, and the more we understand about mathematics and how it relates to cryptography, and the faster our ability has developed to perform calculations, the better cryptography has become. In fact, cryptography has always been commonly used by the military during wartime and during non-wartime situations. It's a great way of encrypting messages to send to soldiers out in the field. It was used extensively in World War II. In fact, it was a major deciding factor in winning the war. The Enigma machine was a famous German encryption machine. The German military developed this machine, which is based on either three or between three and six rotors, depending on how it was used. These rotors would be rotated according to a specific key set, and you can use those rotors to encrypt a message. Effectively, it was a mechanical computer, and it was an extremely effective mechanical computer. It was never actually broken. The way that the Allies broke the code was to generate a prototype which simulated the same functionality of the Enigma machine. Once the Allies had the same effective functionality, they were able to decode messages that they intercepted from the Germans. Very similar situation was going on with the Japanese. They had another machine called the Japanese Purple Machine. This encryption machine had an algorithm that actually was broken. There was a tremendous effort put forth by American mathematicians that were very good at code breaking. They were able to break the code and intercept messages and understand a lot more as to what was going on. It made a big difference, and in fact, it allowed the Allies, in many cases, to win battles and to ultimately win the war.